Mark, disappointing end today to a good run towards the end of the season. What are your thoughts on again? Um, I thought I thought we did really well up until their first goal. I thought we were um, very wary, very conscious of the fact they had scored early in the last couple of games, and that made made a big difference. We, we, we wanted to be, make sure we locked up the middle of the pitch and and try to nullify. Uh, Horton as best we could and I thought we did that well and then actually we, we, we looked the biggest threat in front of goal I thought Ringo had a great chance with a header um, a couple couple of other near misses in around their box a few set pieces that caused um, a bit of panic in their in their back four in their defence um, yeah I thought we first half hour we were going exactly how we sort of as good as we wanted it to really barring maybe getting in front but um, yeah, consider a poor goal, such a poor goal we've been defending so well, been really that resolute hard to break down, but got done with a quick throw in. Um down the line then opportunities to clear, we didn't quite manage to, to get the ball clear and you know it's probably a difference between a team that's getting relegated and a team that's won the league and that when they get the, those moments they score them. Second half found it a little bit more difficult. I don't think they had much in the way of chances but again why they've won the league is when they get them they take them and, and yeah, it looked comfortable for him, but over the course of 90 minutes, we probably had as many, if not more, corners than him, or probably as many, if not more, entries into the into penalty area. Um, but they've taken the sort of half chances that they've had, and um, congratulations to them for, for winning the league. Disappointing, you know, obviously for ourselves, in that we'd stretch it to this point when, when no one thought we would do. Um, just ended a bit flat, but I suppose we could have won the game today 3 0 and, and we'd have still felt the same because obviously the, the blithe result meant that, that it was impossible for us anyway. As you said, it does confirm our relegation to the Northern Premier League. What's next? Um, got to reflect on it. You know, if we've been, myself and Bosch have been doing this for 10 years, it's our 10th season, and we've never, we've always either met or exceeded the target set for us at the start of the season. We've fallen just short this time, so that's a uh, uh, something that we'll have to reflect on, you know, we've got to be accountable, we've signed signed the players in the summer and, you know, we had so many tight games, so many games decided by the odd goal, I think, looking back, um, you know, we lost the likes of Mark Ross, Nicky Clee, Ryan Tulsa, Nokowski, we barely had OJ all season, real experience from our team and, and I think some of those tight games, the ones where last season we probably Nick's little wins where we didn't play particularly well. I don't think we've won enough games where we've not played well this season. I think we've we've um, missed that bit of experience, that bit of nous just to see games through. And um, you know, we, we we've certainly um, so many tight games where where we could have nicked a couple of points. And, and when you you know go down by only four, that that certainly t takes its toll. Um, you know, I had a. Listen to listen to a lot of managers in the league, and, and I heard them say this week about how these you know bad luck and decisions even the way out, and um, so not the case, absolutely not the case. You know we've had so many where penalties in games, red cards, decisions that, that have gone against us, um, yeah, and I think it's sort of been a perfect storm. You know where things have gone against us and, and turned games. Um, it's been been tough to take. I think the lads have deserved more than, than what they've got through the course of the season. We know, you know, Martin Knight was so openly said last couple of seasons we've had the lowest budget across the entire national league. You know, three divisions in the national league, and I'm sure that's no different this time. So we've had to punch above our weight every year we've been here, and we've just just fallen short this time. You know, four points. We can go back and recover all those games, but yeah, disappointing. Obviously, good that, that it's, it's come to this, especially after we took it to the last game, you know, gut and feeling, but we've got to reflect on it, we've got to learn from it, um, the mistakes we've made through the course of the season, um, things that we could have done better, but, you know, it's a tough league, you just look at the money that's been spent up and down it, um, it's a tough, tough league and we've got to, as a club, um, reflect on what's gone on uh, and look to build, so when we come back next time, when we get back up to this level that we're we're in a better position to compete and compete on a regular basis because you know, obviously the injuries that we had um, after Christmas you know, when we had 12, 11, 12 players missing for a good spell of games, we were playing Saturday, Tuesday, we just didn't have the depth in order to, to deal with that and um, yeah but obviously tonight hurts but we'll um, get over it and we'll, we'll see what happens next.